Well, the holiday is now winding down tonight after millions of Americans celebrated the 4th across the country. One of the biggest and most controversial parties was hosted by President Donald Trump on the National Mall in Washington, D.C. NBC's Jay Gray was there. Steady rains can't keep away the crowds or the commander-in-chief. Today we come together as one nation with this very special salute to America. A celebration that includes tanks, troops, and a series of flyovers closed out by the Blue Angels. We celebrate our history, our people, and the heroes who proudly defend our flag, the brave men and women of the United States military. It's the first time in decades a sitting president has been part of the festivities here, joined by thousands on the National Mall. The president is always uh, there supporting uh, the agenda for the United States. But the party is not without protest, including the well-traveled baby Trump balloon and this flag burning just outside the White House. Critics frustrated by the cost of the festivities, estimates are more than two million dollars, and accusing the president of turning the holiday into a political rally, giving prime seats to high-dollar Republican donors. The president is using it as his own holiday. This is the, the President Trump National Day, not the, the National Day of the United States of America. Fireworks early and late in the nation's capital. Jay Gray, NBC News, Washington.